Is Megalodon really extinct or is there a chance they still live in the deep ocean? What if they still exist but we just don't know about it? Megalodon, is an extinct species of shark that lived approximately 23 to 3.6 million years ago. Scientists suggest that Megalodon looked like a stockier version of the great white shark, though some experts believe it may have looked similar to the basking shark or the sand tiger shark. Regarded as one of the largest and most powerful predators to have ever lived, fossil remains of Megalodon suggest that this giant shark reached a maximum length of 18 meters with the average size being 10.5 meters. Megalodon teeth could measure over 18 centimeters in slant height and are the largest of any known shark species. Megalodon had a very robust dentition and had over 250 teeth in its jaws, spanning five rows. It is possible that large Megalodon individuals had jaws spanning roughly two meters across. The Mariana Trench is the deepest part of the world's ocean. The maximum known depth is 10,994 meters. Modern science tells us the megalodon shark is extinct, but could it still live in the Mariana Trench and other deep places in the ocean? Some people think so, and whenever the subject of a living megalodon comes up the Mariana Trench is pointed out as a likely hiding spot. But could any sharks live that deep? While the largest sharks in the world are well known due to their near-surface behaviors, there are others who are much more reclusive. The Portuguese dogfish is a species of sleeper shark known to survive at depths of up to 3,650 meters. The Pacific sleeper shark and Greenland shark are huge animals reaching over 20 feet in length which can live at depths of up to 2,750 meters. Is it really possible that small populations of megalodon sharks evolved to feed on prey in very deep water, and because of this managed to avoid extinction? Could this remnant population of megalodon shark still thrive today, far out of sight of humans?